हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू दी अबाका सी ए टूटोरियल सीरीज टुडे विजिट यू वे लर्न स्टैटिक एनालिसिस ऑफ ए कैंटिलीवर बीम सो लेट्स स्टार्ट फर्स्ट स्टेप यू क्रिएट ए मॉडल बाय क्लिक डबल क्लिक ऑन दी दिस आइकन पार्ट्स डबल क्लिक व्हेन यू डबल क्लिक ऑन दिस पार्ट this window is appear create part the name of the part is beam and this beam is 3d deformable and solid and the grid size is 200 default we take continue click on the continue name must be 1 to 38 character long so we increase the length of the name beam part 1 continue okay the first step is this we create a grid of spacing each box have a spacing of 200 now what you do what we want we want a beam like this this length is 100 you assume 100 meter 100 cm this is the 10 and the width is 25 width is 25 so first we create this view 100 by 10 what we do click on this uh, create lines rectangle and click at the center of the grid and mouse drag and make a rectangle after this click on this dimension line and measure the horizontal line when you measure horizontal line the distance is appear here you input here the length and enter after this measure the depth and create it there here is depth 10 and when you right click on the screen cancel the procedure he asking after the click on done he asking for depth and you provide that 25 now our 3d beam is created next step is property go to the property click on here this icon is for create material and the title is steel and in steel we provide elasticity in, mecha in mechanical property we take e is 210 e3 and the poison ratio is 0.3 and okay we create the property now we make a group and this property apply to the group then this group apply to this model this is the procedure material is done now create a group group name is section that was is homogeneous continue and the material of this section is steel done now this section provide to this beam first of all click on beam and this beam is create as a group of set 1 done then this section 1 apply to the set 1 property of steel we apply to this 3d beam is done now the next step is to assemble and go to the this icon we uh, assemble this beam as a part and is dependent mass on part and okay after this go to the next step is next step is a step and click on the this first icon now we create a step 1 that is initial uh, we analysis we define the analysis procedure we analyze static and general continue then okay after this go to the mass and click on first icon before click here you change this into part object is part we define already this is a part now click again this icon he asking the number of parts size of each part the length of the beam is 100 
and if we put here value 1 he divided into 100 parts but what we do we provide into 20 parts so we put here 5 and ok now the notes is generated but uh, messing is not done now click the on second icon and here yes or no for messing and yes the messing is done after messing go to the load in load first of all we apply support for support we i want to fix this support so we rotate this to my side and go to the support select symmetric bc continue and select this surface this is set one done and the fixed support is and castray and ok now the support is fixed now we again is rotated like this but now next step is load we want to create a concentrated load on uh, we want to uh, create a concentrated load here ok but if we create a point load we need require points and points only here and here so we have to create a nodes here also so what we do go to the load concentrated load one continue set one now he asking which node want to apply load but here is no node so we cancel this procedure now what we do go to the tools set one create and we title is load node this is the for load node and select here node and continue now what we do we select any one joints from the meshing but to when we create the meshing because of the my meshing step of 5 this meshing is not equal mm, or uh, uh, even parts like 1 1 2 3 4 5 if we create 4 meshing then we have uh, uh, we have uh, get a node at the center but because of the my meshing mistake we have don't have the uh, joint at uh, center so we select this joint and then after this we again go to the load select concentrated load now he asking the load but is not load is not appear we again cancel the procedure and again go to the load tools create not set 3 and we select this then done and go to the load something mistake here because when we go to the load no joint is appear to done mm, something error we click here and select continue where set and the load node okay I forget this step okay when we create a from tool and say from here to set a load node then go to the load concentrated load continue now don't have to select the node and click here then you go to the set and then you select the load node continue the load node value is 100 we provide a point load at 100 at the center go to the amplitude equally space continue and take amplitude is one okay here is zero here is one and okay the load is complete then go to the job from here 
and click on this icon continue okay then right click to the job this and submit job okay now analysis is a start after analysis completed we go to the result here you click and check the running is running status running is completed now go to the result and check the stresses go to the deformation and check this is the stresses and you can check result from here type of stress and you can animate this this cantilever beam rotation and this is the tutorial of static analysis of a cantilever beam if you like this tutorial please subscribe my channel share and comment and like also because the civil engineering software is audience civil engineering software tutorial youtube channel audience is very less that's why the view is very less so please if you share and like and comment this video then that help me thank you